So hey guys and welcome back for more State of Mind. With me, Supernautus, how are you today? I hope you're good. If you are, that's great. If you aren't, oh. That's not so good. <laughs> Don't know why I said that. Anyway, right, so. Uh, we're back at our apartment after taking our son to the doctor's. Adam? Um, looks like Mom? his wife is home somewhere has she got in here Adam, thank God. she has I'm better. i am feel, feeling all right i guess you're looking less pale thanks i yeah i, I guess i feel better i don't know what's actually wrong with me something about an accident uh, right can he? Yeah, he, he a crash can. but no rampaging you probably have a thousand questions I don't actually. No, no. Why would you? Questions are fine. My head is spinning. I have to finish up. Has she got transparent hair, or what's the? making you do overtime now. She's wearing some kind of thing that's transparent around her shoulders. It will be great, Adam. Perfect. I don't understand what she's wearing. This accident. Yeah, tell me about the accident. I still can't remember. Was it an accident? Maybe it's for the best. Post stress. Uh, she would say that. If it was so, wasn't an accident. Am I such a bad father? No. I'd say you're more of a huh. I mean, you're not a complete dud. Well that's good, I suppose. <laughs> if a nanny's so bad. John never had problems being alone. John is seven. Mm. You want to work again. I'm hardly at home. Somebody and needs to be here. For him. She'll keep him grounded. Okay? Keep him grounded? Wait, was he bad? Okay. I have to get some work done. Lie down. Get some rest. Yeah, okay. I'll get some rest, I suppose. I suppose it's not the worst idea in the world. Let's have a sleep. Let's see what we find out. Are we going to return to that other guy who's like really angry all the time. Possibly understandably because his family appear to have disappeared. Are these both the same person really? Is that the secret? Different sides of the same person. We're back at Berlin Central so we are back with Nolan the angry man. How are you today sir? Oh. Good. Fantastic. Don't make me anything. Oh, I've got a call coming in. Hey, Richard. How you doing? Not well. Still alive. <laughs> Nanny Central called us today. We were worried about you. Why? I bet you were. Seriously. Frank said you'd rest up for a bit. I'm fine. I'm coming by. I have to have a chat with you anyway. Privately. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Jenny said you might want to do that. Everything happens at once, right? A private conversation. Okay. See you soon. See ya. Not in front of a robot. We've got new entries in our hollow pin board, which is in our bedroom, I think, wasn't it? Quite a lot of new entries, if that's to be believed. Let's see. Tracy got herself scanned for the Mars colony. Tracy's old scanned photographer, did she meet up with him? Uh, Tracy isn't where, with her parents, and where's my son? Who visited Tracy in the apartment? We need to get that module that we took from the robot. You leave me alone. Are you looking for something? Can I help? You can help by shutting down. Yeah. It's a bit harsh, right? I mean, it's just trying to be helpful. Right, so I guess we're leaving the apartment then. Yeah. I've gotta go. I wish you a productive and successful day. Thanks, bye. I finished the first chapter apparently. So that's good, I guess. What does chapter two hold in store for us? So obviously we've got two cities, one very bright and I don't know. As I said, said before, kind of utopian looking, and then this. 
which is very not utopian looking. Shady characters on every street corner. Handing out all sorts of items. A variety of them. And we've got to head to the voice, which is our workplace. Yeah, I mean, this looks like a much more repressive kind of society. Doesn't it? It doesn't look quite as... Uh, it's definitely not as sharp and bright as the other one was. But they are in different countries. So I guess that might have some bearing on it. Uh oh. Passwords, wizards, dark cloud logins. Oh, you can get me all that, can you? I'm not interested in your crap. <laughs> could have, could have. Don't I know you? Maybe. See you later. Now, what's this? What's this? Illegal print item. This item does not fall in accordance with the registration and safety guidelines of the United States of the West. Owning and distributing this item is prohibited. Have that breakpoint fight with us. Break point. Put it in your pocket instead of holding it where everyone can see. A nano scan cell. This cell is the property of the government. Please follow all instructions given by the police. Any damage caused to the cell is punishable by law. Well, we're going in here, so I don't know what if we're going to be punished for that. Who's that guy? No, thanks. I'm expected on floor 247. The building's under surveillance. Comply with instructions. Have we written something the government doesn't like? And is that why this accident happened? I wonder. Why he's lost his memories. Was it intentional? I guess we'll find out. So these people are writing a variety of articles and there we've got the time in a variety of countries. And this is the voice. And it's not a TV show about singing. Oddly enough. So we got New York, London, Berlin, Moscow, and Tokyo. Good morning. 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 Richard, I'll talk to you later. Yeah, okay. Uh, who is he? That is Mr. Davis. And who's Mr. Davis? Davis? Never heard of him. Is he new? Mr. Lloyd will introduce you. He is expecting. Okay. God, what's the emergency? I'll go talk to Steve first. Okay, where's Steve then? Is he in Minecraft? Richard. Come on, let's take a look at you. There he is, he's over there, Luke. But let's talk to this person hey, first. Could you give us a minute? Of course. What's going on? Hold on a second. Hey, you, you look good. You should go to hospital. You should go to hospital more often, well. Rest up for a little while longer, okay? Sure. Talk, Steve. Ah, oh, nonsense. We got Troy now. We've got Troy now. Hey, there he is, know. that's the guy again. What is Troy doing here? Why did Frank yeah, what's his job? Well, what's his position? Support for the team, that's all he told me. Support for the team. Listen, Steve, I've got to talk to you. It's about Tracy. Yeah, she's disappeared. You're not splitting up, are you? Well, who knows? What makes you think that? Well, nothing. Just a... Uh, just a what? Just a what? A hunch. What makes you think that, Steve? Did Tracy tell you something? Well, Maybe she did. Jennifer mentioned something along those lines that you're fighting. Hmm. And why didn't you say anything? Because people fight, it happens. You weren't here? You gonna split up. I mean Look. Tracy's gone. Yeah, disappeared. What do you mean gone? I mean she said don't know where she, she is. To take James to her parents and come back Sunday. That was yesterday. Have you been looking for her? I've called everywhere. She's not at her parents, yeah. she's not at the hospital. Well, she'll be back soon, I'm sure. Will she? I think she's with another man, Steve. No. She bought a bot. One of those base five things. Yeah, we got a bot that he didn't want. What'd she buy that for? <laughs> you and me, probably. Maybe. The bot has a memory chip. Yeah. So, I want to check its log. 
The bot recorded who entered my apartment. Yeah. If she's leaving, fine. But James is staying with me. I get it. Uh, okay, now. now I know those chips are encrypted. And that's where you come in. Just you want him to just break encryption on something that's probably illegal, right? Is that what you want him to do? That's a level two encryption. That's made so he can decrypt it for me. Time, though. At least an hour. It'll take an hour. Talk to Frank anyway. hey, Will that take an hour? Too much. There'll be an explanation. Will it take an hour to talk to this guy? Frank, he's presumably he's the editor or something of this. I'm ready. Okay, well, where are you? Is that his office over there? Hey, all good? There's been yet another bombing attack on Kurt's robotics. Bombing attack on Kurt's robotics. Let's have a coffee. And then we'll go and speak to the guy. Drink some coffee. Or at least have some coffee. Yes, have some. Is it through here? No. Where's this Frank guy? Where do I... Oh, I guess if I go down... Oh, there's a buffet. You can't pass that without having something to eat, right? Japanese delicacies. Due to the trade embargo with the Eastern Union, some meals can only be prepared via food assembler. The criminal hacked the communication service of the cloud. The hackers created vast numbers of... Calls. A lot of stories about hackers. Oh, this is the guy's office, is it? It's hey, in a little pod. A long time no see. Hey. Because I wasn't here. <laughs> He's a bit... I don't know. Well, let's go and talk to Frank first. I don't think that Troy guy is going to tell me anything Richard, until. Come in. That's what I was doing. What have you gotten yourself into? Yeah, no idea. Just an accident. As far as I know. Can't remember anything. No. Nope. The accident now. Was it an accident? The say? they said I'll get over it. That's of course they did. <laughs> You'll have to tolerate me a little longer yet. <laughs> well, maybe. Uh, uh, Richard, listen. You don't have to rush back into it. Think of your health. Well, I do, but they're not here, so. You're talking as if I were on death's door, Frank. I'm fine. You should take a step back. Really, don't worry about work. We'll be fine. Are they trying to replace him, or? What do you mean? Is there something I should know? Wait a second. Uh, Mr. Lloyd, I have time now. Oh, good. Yeah, just bring him in too. Why not? Apologies. Let me close the door. Okay. Now we won't be interrupted. What's going on? Okay. Listen, Richard. I've been wanting to talk to you for a while about this. We've been given new directives from the management. Uh huh. Yes. Uh, so what does it management want? The work you're doing. Uh, what about my Am work? Fired? You can't be serious, Frank. Well, we never no, said that yet, did he? We, we are just restructuring a little. By restructuring, do you mean that you're changing entirely with your messages? Contract for one year, and then after that, we'll see. Wow. You're kicking me out. I can't believe it. Look, you've done a lot for the boys, and we really want to hold on to you. Oh, Mainly because you don't want me to report something about you, right? There's been criticism. So what? I'm a journalist, Frank, not a stenographer. Ah, uh, maybe. You were a journalist, and a damn good one. Uh huh. Where am I now? You've turned into a man with an agenda. It's not entirely untrue, is it? Mankind's abolishing itself, Frank. I mean, and what? We can't write about that now. I'm not a terrorist, Richard. It's out of my control. I don't reckon he can do much about any of it, though, can he? I think that's the problem. I understand. Can I at least keep my desk in the newsroom, Richard? We've known each other for a long time. So no is the answer that he's fine. Got it. But you are always welcome here. You can keep using the cloud services. Okay. Great. If you need anything, I'll come to you. Hey, we're professional. Right, so basically he's been you know as well as I do kicked out of his know. job. Sure, Frank. You probably have stuff to do. So does that mean my articles need to be more... professional? Is that what they want? Now, who's this guy? Mr. Nolan. Yes? I wanted to introduce myself. Go on, then. Fine. 
If I'm not allowed to be here, I'm not interested in what you got to say, you see? Who else do we have around us? Work hub. Is this my desk? Property of the voice. Authorization granted uh, other users Frank Lloyd and Troy Davis. So yeah, he's taking over my work, apparently. So let's go see if he's managed to get my uh, stuff decrypted yet. No, I don't know nothing. What's up? Something happened? A crappy job. You could say that, I suppose. If not doing any work's a crappy job. I'm fired. Well, I'm not. Thrown out. Yeah. Why? You'll have to ask Frank. Some nonsense. He's not been fired, does he? He's still got a job, but. But with a short-term freelance contract. Yeah. Unbelievable. You should get a lawyer. Would it make a difference? So you have to clear your desk now? Your new colleague Troy will be sitting there tomorrow. Frank is still letting me run around here a bit, though. I can still use the network. Yeah. Generous, right? How's the memory chip coming along? Oh, yeah. It's, it's done. done. Good. And what's on it? Show me. Okay, fine. Uh oh. Right, let's see. Who was there? That's the entrance to the apartment. Well, this is weird. Right, so I can't go that way. I can't go anywhere. What's the deal with that? Is he hiding something from me? There she is. With her suitcase. Pretty broken up. Whatever it is. Aha! Who's this guy? What's going on there? Oh, hello. Does it? Did that look better? That's the same thing, right? Okay. How does that help me? That's that's this place again. That's not it. Almost got it. Okay, that looks better. Almost got it. Okay, we've almost got whatever it is he's remembering. There. There. There he is. You see him? Yeah. What is that idiot doing in my apartment? Who is that? He looks like he's helping Teresa pack. Is that that Lloyd guy? He's speaking to my boy. Yeah. Any sound on this? I'll kill him, Steve. I swear to you, I'll end his life. Who is that? Tracy has to do with him. He could just be helping her move. Helping her Why would he? It's I don't know. Going on. Seems a bit odd. Tracy ran off with this, this, and James. She took James mm. too. I have to know who that is. I have to get my boy back. Yeah, who is that? Help me, Steve. What? Identify him? Sure. I can try. Go on then. Try. Harrison. Send it through the database. Okay. We find anyone? Well, he's completely like unknown. Maybe. In the cloud. Maybe. Maybe. Like it, but what are we going to do? Move scan. We'll check his movement profile and find out who he is. Richard, move scan. Yeah, I think you're, if that's a police database, I think you're starting to get a bit. Didn't you write a huge article about that? I know, Steve, but this is Yeah, uh, hypocrisy, hypocrisy. Yeah. Anyway, how are you going to get clearance? I'll take care of that. There's sources out there. Yeah, but... Thanks for now. I have to go. I'll call you. 
I love these drones flying around that are obviously making sure people aren't doing things they're not supposed to. I guess we're leaving then. To try and find out who that person was. Does that mean we're going to have to go and speak to those dodgy guys that are dealing all sorts of dodgy information or things? Oh, there's more robots there now. There was only one there before, right? Yeah, there was only one there before. Now there are three. The guy with, like, some headphones on. There's a dealer. Okay, so that one can't tell me anything, but these guys here might be able to tell me something. Although this is probably not a great plan. No way. Long time no see, man. Hmm. You need something? Hmm, I, I knew it. Well, yeah, I kind of do. Just here. Your friend, Jace. Hey, not now, dude. Jace is talking. You're Dr. Roboarm. Dr. Roboarm. About an hour ago. Are you totally sure? Was that that guy? Oh, he's on the phone. Okay. I said you have illegal passwords. I need one from you. Uh, uh, that's 800. All 800. 800 what? Oh, what do you know? Here he comes again. Okay. I'll call you back later. Uh, he's decided he's interested in what I'm doing now. Hmm. Okay. Anything else? No, that, that'll be... <laughs> I was just talking about you. What, were you? Really? Why? With whom? Maybe you want to tell me your name. What for? I'd like to know who I'm doing business with. Okay, fine. Richard. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Just Richard... Uh-oh. Nolan. Richard Nolan. I'm a journalist. Sure. Richard Nolan. Are they going to be happy about me buying this stuff? Are they going to think that I'm writing a story about them? But you do. Why? Why? What? Hey, hey, wait a minute. Relax. I just wanted to meet cop. I'm not. What? Pretend to buy. Pick another fake I'm not a cop. I'm not a What's? Cop. Richard Nolan is dead. What? Says who? Wait, what? Says James. He sends his regards and wishes you a pleasant stay in hospital. Deal. Wait, what? I don't think there was anything I could do about that. So. Or should I have not spoken to them? No, I think I had to, didn't I? Okay, so... Richard Nolan is apparently dead. And now this guy Adam's woken up at a... Oh, he's having a dream about his accident. I guess. Torn walls, everything's kind of wobbling a bit. This is the cab. Vehicles the property of Cab Car Inc. Use at your own risk. Cab Car Inc. takes no responsibility for damage to person or property. Oh, what's that? That's an interesting looking item. Oh, I can't get hold of any of it though. Because it is just a dream. And now we're falling. What's that? Oh, whoa! We're in space! No? Ow. Okay, so I can move around and I can grab things. Find Charlie! Is it that kind of game now? Find Charlie. I didn't know you could get that kind of thing in here. Okay, we're awake. And I've got new entries on my hollow pin board. And there's that music again. I'm still hearing it. What a night. Yeah. Adam woke up from his dream. Was there a way that I could not wake up from my dream? What exactly? Uh, my hollow thing's here, isn't it? Present on sick leave today. 
Please note down any observations. Double vision, vertical memory loss. He talks little. Okay, well, there's not much to see on that pin board right now. So who's Charlie? This is this uh, circle that he was drawing. I say circle, it's... Circle. I mean, kind of, but not really. Well, she's at home, right? So, who's Charlie? There, okay, that's the food assembler. That's all those pictures. should be asking yourself every day what's this are you truly happy happiness a note from amy for john brain. that's private tell you a lot about your happy brain about dendrites and synapses but that would be quite boring is it teaching him while he's asleep instead, imagine a cave a small what is that Ooh. some sort of fragmented data that's not a good sign Yeah, if it isn't gone already. If it isn't gone already. Or is this some kind of sleepy test? What kind of test would it be? <laughs> How would it be a test? It's a test of something. Okay, so we're here. Now we're back at Berlin Central with Nolan again, who's just been beaten down by a bunch of information brokers. I mean, if they're going to leave me alive and they think that I'm a cop, why would they... Steve, I've got an incoming call from him. No, because I was attacked by some dodgy guys. How did he know that? Come up here. Well, you want me to go back to work? Okay, but... Hmm. They said I'm not who I think I am. Should I stay away from them? Oh, what's this kiosk got at it? Randy. Nolan. What happened? So he knows I'm Nolan. Don't call Medi Central. Okay, so. Do you have children? Help our authorities improve the lives of future generations. So some people know that I'm Nolan and don't have an issue with that. But those people think that I'm dead. Well, that's odd. Something's not adding up here. Or if it is, it's adding up to the wrong answer. No, Did well, no, <laughs> no, there's a question. Yeah. Am I Don't a walking like corpse? Just a password. Will you help me? Fine. If it works, if it doesn't immediately get you caught. I can't do that all online. I have to get a copy of the database first. How long will that take? A day at least. Okay. Have I been replaced by like a robot? A stuff to do anyway. You know, concerning those dealers. A cyborg? No, I'm not going to report them, because then they just have to say. That I'm dead. What? I, that, that's a joke, surely. See how he reacts to this. Didn't sound like it. Some guy called Jay is telling everybody apparently. G. 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 They're high. They hang out all day in Neverland or wherever it is they go these days. J or maybe J A Y. Do you know who they meant by that? No. Maybe a hacker. Something with Wiggy's arm. Yeah, Ro Dr. Roboarm. Th that rings a bell. Wasn't there a, an Arco? An Anarcho? An anarchist, you mean? Now, hold on. I'll send you some material from the archives. Please do. Yeah, that'd be helpful. I think. I hope. What do we have here? Unknown assailants assault police station. Theft of database technology. Uh. 
help with that series. Attackers breached the doors of the police station guarded by only two police bots. So what does that mean? That looks interesting. Cyber criminals hack the cloud. They could create and distribute false IDs on a large scale. That sounds interesting. Jack McHale. Killed on June 22nd, 2046 during a drone attack. That's definitely something we want to keep. I don't know about these. Let's keep them off just now. Base 6 bot's about to be released. The new series of androids is about to start in North America. Owners of previous models can continue to use spare parts like arms or legs. Just like ordinary augmentations. Jeff Kazowski, augmented arm. We'll amputate one of his biological arms and replace it with an augmentation. That sounds possible. Good lord. Police bots have a new one. New hard points for an automatic weapon. Vehicles hacked. Hackers, probably. Hmm. I can only assign three things at a time. I think we'll put that one back. I think this is the guy we're looking for. Surely. Oops. I assign that. Hmm. It's interesting. Jack McHale again. Can't be him. Could be. Tracks from hackers and data anarchists and governmental and private networks increased again. This was stated in the final point. Jonathan Miller. Hmm. J. J. Kazowski, wanted terrorist in hiding. Hmm. Okay, but where? What do I need to get rid of then? Have a look at that. Has to be him, right? It has to be that one. So, okay. Okay, that looks better. This guy. I don't think that one's right. Search Labs, J. Kozowski eluded police summoning and subsequent questioning by fleeing to an unknown location. Suspected to have connections to terrorist organisations. So take that one away. Where was that one about the... There. This looks interesting. Let's see. Yeah. And then disappeared. I think that's probably the place we want to look. I don't think that's a good place to try and go to, but... You want to go to Doomsday? Are you mad? I mean, what other choice do I have? And that seems like the best place to look. I could be going to completely the wrong place. I don't know, Steve. I don't have a good feeling about it. No. Why does he think I'm dead? Maybe he knows something about Jane, too. Maybe. Well, let's find out. Am I going to have to go home and use a computer at home? Should I just be going straight to this doomsday place? What am I doing? This is my work hub, but I can't use it. So maybe we need to go home. In Berlin, there's been yet another bombing. A bombing attack on Kurtz Robotics. Good way to hide your involvement, wouldn't it be? I don't know. 
feel like there's something more that we're just not getting. So we can use a cab to get to that place. But I wonder if it's worth trying to go home first. Just so I can see if there's anything we can do here with regard to the um, the password thing that we got. Oddly enough, they never took it off us. What does it look like? Does it? A successful day so far. No. Leave me alone. Let's have a look. Okay, so I can't... can't use that. I hoped I could use that to uh, access information. But it looks like I can't. With this move net thing. Everything's gone. Right, I think we need to just go to... Um, oh, hang on. No, I think we need to just go to this club. As dangerous as I think it might be, I guess we need to go here. It's the only lead we've got, right? So let's do that. Can I not use a cab? Apparently, I can't use a cab. But what's this? Homeless person. Bot stole my job. And Felix Anders, geolocation missing, unemployed. Okay. That was nano scan required. I need a valid nano scan. Are they all gone from there, are they? Is there anything down here before I make my way anywhere else? Guy kind of hid around this corner, didn't he? But there's nothing there. Okay. It's getting mysterious. We can't use the cab. Can I use this up here? What is this? Oh yeah, here we go. We'll head to Doomsday. And see if that's the place we need to be the only potential place we need to be, I can imagine. Hmm. It's, a, it's an interesting... It's an interesting story. Some mysterious things going on. Uh, we're at Sector 36. Doomsday. Not the day, but... It's a club. Apparently. He's healing up nicely from his punch in the face, anyway. Maybe a little too nicely. No, they're getting raided now. Oh, well, no, there's a lot of police, anyway. It's this flyer. Neverland, the island in your mind. The most popular virtual world of all time. No streaming. Unauthorized streamers will be permanently banned. So by that you mean anyone that streams, right? So that's Doomsday. And there's the police. Berlin police, stay behind the line, he says. Measure for my security. That's a lot of noise. I think they're about to raid this place. So I think it might be sensible for me not to go in right now. Why would you want to go in right now when there's a massive police presence? Richard Nolan? Just yeah. Okay. I almost didn't recognize you. You have some nerve to come back here. Uh, to come back here? Techno capitalism gathers to die. In your article back then? Yeah. Hey, but I'm in a bit of a hurry. Hey, is that not the guy that oh, I suppose he could just look very similar. No. Do I play Neverland? Uh, yeah, sure, if you're in it. 
What kind of stuff? Some noob. Okay, so we don't have anything that we need from him right now. That obviously might change. Stop talking to me. Although that is something I want to know. However, right, let's go back. Unable to recognize ID. Nice. We're going to have to try and get in this club. Hold up. Not, you. not me. Um. Yeah. No. Right. Yeah. I'm so sorry. What's that mean? I mean, you're not interested in helping me. Maybe this guy can get me one. Disabling all signals. I think they're probably trying to raid the place. She still won't help me though. Maybe this guy can. The guy's back. Yeah. No, I need it right now. Interesting. Is anything this guy does legal? I guess that. How much? Nine hundred? Nine hundred. I can live for a month off that much. Yeah. Hey, there are drones everywhere, man. You want a deal like that? Go to Neverland. Fine. And here you go. Your wizard. Awesome. Now maybe I can let her use that. Okay. I think that was it. I think we've just hacked the signal. And this is Mina. No, she's not. She's missing. Yeah, I need inside. Can you get me inside? I need to meet a couple of people at the club and you don't have a companion code. Exactly. I'll send you one. Meet me inside by the entrance. No data from unknown. Sweet. That'll allow us in. My companion code. Yeah, there you go. A friend. Thanks. How do we get inside? Is that the do that's the door? Okay. So we're trying to meet this person inside the entrance somewhere. She's not here. Yes, the green one's the one we want to go through, right? Do I have to pay to get in here, or nobody's there? And there she is. Richard Nolan. Yeah. Tracy's gonna kill you. You don't have to tell her. Well, she never calls anywhere. Yeah, I don't know where she is. No, it's fine. I get it. Family, kids. It hasn't been easy for her recently. No. Oh, come on. She still calls Jennifer. Is she still working for Bote? I don't think so. <laughs> you really haven't seen each other in a while. <laughs> no. I'm looking for a certain Jack. Do we want to go direct? Oh God! What do you want from him? Well, apparently, he thinks I'm dead. Just need to get to know him. Uh huh. Well, if you need to, ask Louisa behind the bar. Louisa behind the bar. Richard, wait a second. What? Does Tracy still do? You know. Do what? No, I don't. You know. <laughs> don't look at me like that. I what does she still do? What? Some sort of virtual really stuff for. 
some sort of drug. How is that possible? Thanks. You're the best. Okay, I'll give you a little bit of money. Taking a break from family life. Well, he doesn't have one right now. Right. So the bar. He said. Go and speak to the person behind the bar. Not the DJ. Let's go downstairs. I see the person we're looking for. The question is, will that person be any help to us at all? Are we about to be raided? Yeah. Uh, well... Do I? Weird. I put money on it. But he was younger, right? Who? Nolan or me? <laughs> Nolan's great. You don't remember Drone Gate? That was a bit. Ooh. That was good ten years ago. Malcolm. That's interesting. I'm looking for someone. A certain Jeff. Jeff? Everybody knows there's no Jeff here. I've heard. Yeah, there's no Jeff here. Yeah? What's your name? Well, as far as I know, that's who I am. Maybe we should have a drink. Oh, shit, I've never heard that one before. The narc wants to buy me a drink. What do you think of that? I got another suggestion. You finish your drink and disappear. I think I made a mistake there, didn't I? So who's this guy? Hey, what's with Jeff? Why are you leading up? Okay, Richard Nolan. I'll tell you something. In this place, you better not ask dumb questions. Well, you know people or you don't. Got it. I wouldn't have asked if it wasn't important. If it was important, you'd know Jeff. Well, it is important, mate. Huh. Here you are again. He doesn't get it, does he? Listen, I No, I don't get it. No. There's no Jeff here. <laughs> Another vodka? Not now, thanks. Okay, let me know. Hmm. I think there probably is. But I think we might need to get someone to run a bit of distraction. Because I think the bar, the woman behind the bar wants to tell us. And? Having fun? Well, not really. You don't happen to have the barmaid's contact, do you? Louisa? What you got planned? I just want to try and talk to her without being... Sure. If you say so. I'll send it to you. For a few credits, okay? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Money. Everything costs money. He's gonna have no money left by the end of this. Wow. 30 credits? Seriously? Go buy something to eat. 30 credits. I don't mean it like that, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I bet you don't. Anyway. Where am I going to go to be alone? In the bathroom? Well, that's not going to work, is it? Not here. Okay. I need to find somewhere where no one's going to be watching me. What about... Can I go outside? Okay, so we can't leave, which means I can't stand outside the door and make the call. Is there somewhere I can go here that's private? And I'm assuming that eventually, at some point soon, police are going to arrive and bust this place. I need to get out of my conversations. Not how it works, darling. I need more than that. Okay. okay. Fine. He's been telling people I'm dead. Dead? Yes, dead. Obviously, I'd like to talk to him about Not how it works. The I think the police are just trying to bust them. Is that even her? Hey. Who are you? Not important. I think I saw that guy. He's doing it again. 
Go to the control room for the light show on the second floor. Can you get out of my way? There we go. Okay, so use this. Okay. Where are the drones? Am I supposed to fry them? What exactly am I supposed to do here? There's one. I see one there, but I can't hit it. Is that one? I can't quite reach them. Alright, I see, so I can fry them if I can hit them. There's another one down. Where's the other one? There was a third one. It's over there. How do I, how do I hit it though? It's, look, it's behind this. Can't hit it from that angle. Is that one? No. Where's the third one? Oh no, wait, I did get it. Are there any more? Yeah, that seems to be it. Oh, good. Yeah. I have to speak to Jeff Kozowski. Many do. Yeah, many, many do, I'm sure. Richard Nolan? That's me. That's it. And you're Jeff, right? The hell, man, you're dead. I'm not. Yeah, I heard that too. How did you survive? <laughs> How did you get out of the building? There were drones and drones everywhere. I think I'd like my questions answered first. Yeah, what well, why are you saying I'm dead? It. it probably happened just when the upload was happening. That's a serious override. Your mind shouldn't be here. At the very least, you should be in a coma. What are you talking about? I want to know what's Yeah, what's happening? Is that why his wife and son did, went away? Because they think he's dead. Richard, according to our sources, you were in one of Kirk's labs about a week ago. Were you doing research there? Were you there of your own? He doesn't remember, probably. I wasn't in a Kirk's lab. I had an accident. Okay, you don't know anything. No. Someone's rewritten his memories. I did read that, yeah. That you were in. I promise we have no idea, otherwise we would have... I wasn't in a lab, I was in a cab. You were have in they... a lab, we didn't find out until after the evaluation. Assigned that you other accident to him. Carried out the attack? He was in a cab. And why was I there? And the other guy, Adam, was in a cab. James, were they? Okay, Richard, listen. Kirk's labs have been working on a project. We recently found out about it. Have they implanted they his memories? There we go. Upload brains? As in mind uploads? Exactly. They're uploading people. Probably against their will. That's interesting. Uploads. Exactly. And you believe they have uploaded you? Me? Yeah. So what they've probably done... That's crazy. I'm here. You are. That's the amazing part. But some of your data is somewhere Yeah. Somewhere else? Where? We don't know. In someone else? Oh no, there's a question. Is the other guy real? Or is that a virtual world? But I am here. Yes and no. What do you mean? There is some kind of copy. It's probably mine. A copy? You mean a second Richard? A second person. We don't know how yep. there he is. What is missing from him. There he is. 
stabilize the pressure. Most of your data has is. been deleted though, so we have to make do with second and third grade material. So what we need to get Relatives, the other version of me. You ever come into contact with. How much data do you have? Do, so do they all think I'm dead? A moment, bro. I crashed. I went to the hospital. That's no, Richard. They tried to upload me. That's the story. And my family? So, where I thought they were like two protagonists, Did you have problems? they're actually technically the same person. Problems? What makes you think that? Yeah. Just trying to make sense of it all. How did you get in the lab? Was it your decision? Did you agree if he doesn't remember going to the lab. Don't remember. Maybe your alter ego knows more. He's a part of it. Contact him. He goes by the name of Adam Neiman. Adam Neiman. Yeah. You want me to and he works for a different database. company. Completely encrypted. You can't read any of it. He probably can. Why? Why? Why can he read it? Because he is in a virtual world. Yeah. Of course that he is. One is me? No. Of course he is. That one's a virtual construct. Based on your memory. So he has a virtual version of me. So he'll help us find Charlie and your family. So that's why we got that vision of find Charlie. Who's we? Breakpoint. I have to reconstruct my memory. Yeah, apparently so. So his and mine. Except his is not real, and it's mine. Very confusing. Contact me. Phil will give you a couple of toys. Believe me. We'll stay in touch, Richard. Oh, there he is. Good. So this is Phil. Let's go and talk to Phil. Ha <laughs> ha, you wish. Yeah. And how was it with Jeff? It was, uh, yeah. He said you had something for me. Oh, yeah. Just some standard equipment. First things first. A hacked ID. If you get caught with this thing, you're in trouble. Got it? Got it. Yeah. Good. I'll also set up a cloud call encryption for you. Okay. So we've got an encryption for cloud call. And we're done. For now. You're off the data radar. Any questions? No, not right now. I guess. I mean... Welcome to the other side of the law. Go to the terminal, and I'll show you a couple of our tricks. Cool, okay. I'll show you how to take control of a search drone. Go. Just getting that positioned right with the with the stick. Look at everything. Get a feel for the system. Get to know the controls first. Yeah, okay. Searching for a Jack. Jack, Jack someone. Who works for a virtual reality company. Okay. See if you can find him. Is it that guy? Because he was annoying. The it is him. We have are still accurate. It is him. Surely. That's not him. Keep looking. Okay, well that's not him. Bald and he has a beard. Bald and a beard. Jack something. I mean he has got a bald spot, is it him? in the bathroom he's not bald he doesn't have a beard and I'm just gonna look at people in the bathroom too but luckily there's nobody in there oh wait hello is it you Penny's working for a VR venture. Yeah. there he is Jack Tramp What did we just do to him? What was that about? Who is that? What did you do? Fried him. Hey, my friend. You know the old phrase. The more you know, the less you know. Yeah, I guess. 
I guess. So was that it? Someone now going to go and pick him up from the bathroom floor. Let's look at some people dancing, I guess. Oh, there's a grenade. That's the police raiding the place now. I knew there was going to be a raid. What, are they just knocking everyone out with gas, or...? Oh, shit. The cops. Yeah, of course it is. Well, how are we going to get out of here alive? Everyone's under arrest, no matter what. Will they arrest me, though? They're in. They don't mess around. And now they're throwing Molotovs at the... Is that a good idea? Does fire do a lot of damage to robots like that? These people are going to fight them. They are actually going to fight these things. Hand to hand. These things which have guns. And presumably no care about collateral. Wow. It's just, it's a, it's just a slaughter. basically going to be dead, right? How am I going to get out of here? Okay, there's a secret passage. See you later then, pal. Is that door going to shut behind me, though, or are the police going to follow me? Okay, where are we? We're coming out by the bins. Somewhere. Well, I mean, if we're far enough away, the police won't think I've got anything to do with it, right? I mean, I, I hope. Okay, guys, well, we found out some more interesting things. So, yeah, Adam is a virtual representation of Richard, kind of, with different memories. Uh, so, I hope you've enjoyed watching a bit more of State of Mind, and we will definitely be coming back to that fairly soon, I'm sure. Uh, but for now, thank you very much for watching. Hope you've enjoyed it. If you have, please feel free to hit that like button. Maybe add a subscription. And I'll see you next time. Possibly. <laughs> Goodbye for now.